I'm going to show you how to make your very own Secrets of Dumbledore book art in seven easy steps. And you'll also learn how to make any book folding design that you can imagine. Hey! First, choose a book. Preferably a hardcover book that you no longer want to read. It doesn't make sense anymore. Then download your free template from the link in the description. If you want the ability to make any design that you can imagine, then all you need is my blank template from Etsy. Shoo! Print your design and make sure it fits and then stick it in the template. Fold the top of the template over the pages of the book. Before doing this, you can move it up or down to adjust how high your picture will be. Choose the paper ruler that suits how long your book is and glue it to the template. The paper rulers allow you to make this design with a book of practically any number of pages. Before you cut any pages, they get folded in just like this. I usually leave about the first 10 pages blank. These ones. So these only need to be folded. After casting your Patronus charm at the like button, align the template with the first page that needs to be cut. That's this one here. The page should be just barely touching the left edge of the design. Draw a line wherever they meet. Make sure that you never, ever forget to cross off that part of the paper ruler. So when someone demands that you get them a cup of water, you don't lose track of where you're up to. Mm -hmm. Cut along the lines that you drew and push in the flaps. You can use a card to ensure a consistent distance with your flap pushing. Hey, where'd my scissors go? I'll come back here. Flick. Now just repeat the process. Move to the next line on the ruler, mark and cut where the design touches the pages and push in the flaps. To decorate the book, I stuck strips of black paper on top of every flap and I colored the words by using a silver metallic marker. There are many ways to decorate your completed book art. Check out this video for a unique idea.